Hey, what is going on, guys? Jubel here, and today I have a 200 plus kill game on 6v6 New Town Demolition. You guys are probably gonna say it takes absolutely no skill to get a high kill game on this Demolition, especially on New Town. Well, I don't see you uploading 200 pluses on with this game type onto your channel, so I don't want to hear it. So basically, I'm using the A94 Fast Max Stock Flag Jacket Hardline uh, Scavenger Tactical Mask MP Grenade and C4. So uh, today I'm gonna be talking about like getting better at Call of Duty, the time it takes to get better at Call of Duty, and just like the, just like, generally, like, being good at Call of Duty, and like, the steps to being good. So, ba like, everyone's always asking me, well, my clan members sometimes ask me, dude, how are you so good? Where do you learn how to, like, play like this, and stuff like that? Well, I don't learn from anyone, technically, I just, like, pick up the skills as I play along. So, my first Call of Duty was... Technically, Modern Warfare 2, because I used to always go to a friend's house and just mess around on it, even though it was garbage. But, like, when I got my Xbox, Black Ops 1 was ba was my first Call of Duty. So, what happened is that Call of Duty Black Ops 1, I was complete garbage at it. Like, I had a .56 KD ratio. Like, that may be decent to some people, but no, that's, that's like, absolutely like, terrible. And part of the reason why that KD was so low is because... That game was bad to me in general. I don't know about you guys. I don't know if it's a good de good game. I really don't like it that much to be honest. But yeah, Black Ops One. That's where I basically started like learning how to shoot guns, learning play sensitivity, um, learning how to just play map right, play strategically. That that's starters, and that was that took me about three four months. So yeah, Modern Warfare Three came out. I got it on release. Played with a whole bunch of friends. That was where. I developed mostly how my play style is and just went off on people. So, first month, I had a .5 KD. I was, like, I wasn't the best, but I was garbage. So, I eventually, like, I met this guy named Orlando, or his game is Orlando. Uh, I joined his Call of Duty Elite Clan. We've been playing ever since. We, we still do now. And, basically, uh, he's the, probably the number one reason why I'm as good as I am today at Call of Duty, as long as some other inspirations on YouTube, right? But he's basically the major influence. So, at, like, I didn't know what to run in, called in Modern Warfare 3. Like, I had no, uh, no sense of class setups, no sense of perk usage, any of that. I had no, like, idea what to use. I just, like, threw on a random gun, some perks I thought were decent, and just played. Well, basically, he taught me how to, like, run certain classes, play a certain way, Jump and drop. Well, I didn't really develop that, but you, you get the point. That's where I basically learned, and that's when I started dropping Moabs. That's when I learned how to play six minutes. That's when I learned how to get map control and spawn control and learning spawns, basically. And that was Modern Warfare 3, basically. Just get Moabs, play with the team, and that's basically it. Black Ops 2 comes out. I get it on release. I start off with a 3.5k and start dropping to a 1.5. 3, I believe, or 1.4, then I reset, and my KD was a 2, then I reset again, now it's like a 4, so yeah. Um, for the most part, Black Ops 2 is where I developed gun skill, like, it's not that I didn't have gun skill model for 3, it's just that they, it wasn't as good, or as fresh I was, as it was now. Like, model for 3, I, I learned how to drop shot every once in a while. Black Ops 2 comes along, one of my friends teaches me how to play tactical, or just like, use tactical correctly. So I play tactical, I, I get used to it, and it's pretty good, right? And then I get control freaks. My aim is off, is off the charts. It's amazing. And then there's Black Ops 2 is where I learned how to jump shot and drop shot like no other. Uh, like, I don't drop as much, but I still do. Jump shotting, it's like incredible. Like, you, if you jump shot for like mid-range to somewhat long range and close ranges, you'll win, like, you have like a 10% increase in... When in the gunfight. That's why I like it so much. And Call of Duty Ghost, that I that I expect myself to be good. I'm not gonna like uh s like just say I am because I think I'm good and all, but no. But yeah, Black Ops 2, that's where I played six man for like half the time I've been on Xbox for Black Ops 2. Most of the time I play full teams, full support. And and I don't normally run lethal, I I normally just run support for the entire team. We all run support for each other. For non-lethal nuclears, right? So that's basically Black Ops 2 for me. Now, at this point, I'm two months away from Ghost. I'm waiting for Ghost. Like, I'm dying for it. 
at this point, and I just want to like see how good I am at because it's it's an Infinity War game. I really like Infinity Ward because they make the multiplayer good, but Black Ops or well, Treyarch technically, they know how to make the maps. So if that makes any sense to you guys, like they make the colors and everything bright, and it's all kind of cool and all. Modern Warfare 3, they know how to make the guns. They know how to like nerf, balance, all, all that shit, right? That's why I like it so much. I, and I'm actually kind of happy they took quick scoping slash sniping out of Ghost. So where they make you have to hard scope. Because I'm, I'm like 12 for nuclear. Some asshole just fucking no scopes or just quick scopes my dome off. Like that that makes no sense. It's like me slapping you with a fucking sl frying slice of bacon across your forehead. And making your cr hairline look like LeBron James hairline. No offense, no offense LeBron James. But you get the point. So... I mean, I, I don't think it's that bad in general, but for the most part, uh, that's where I develop gun skill. I I expect myself to keep improving. I'm starting to play competitive now, and I've taken a huge interest into it. I don't know why. It's just really fun to me. But, yeah, this is a 231-3 demolition gameplay. I got, like, a month or two back, back when Double XP Weekend was going on. And I just wanted to upload it whenever I had the chance to, and I guess I have the chance now. So, like, I, I think, I guess I'm boring you guys at this point. I've been talking for, like, six minutes straight. So, I'm going to uh, call it quits here and, like, play some song for you guys that you guys might enjoy. So, if you guys enjoyed this 200 plus, well, 231 to 3 gameplay on 6v6, remember that, 6v6, go ahead, please drop a like. Uh, maybe subscribe to me as well. And I hope you guys have a good day. Uh, whatever song we're playing, I hope you guys enjoyed that too. If you guys want to play me, my gamer tag is Glow Aura. My second account is Yubel. So yeah, doses. It seems like the world is testing me. Will I conquer or will I get the best of me? Half of the world sees success in me, the other half is second guessing me. But I kid you not, don't mess with me. Cause I think I got something possessed in me. No matter what, I'm gonna give what's left to me. I didn't choose this life, it was destiny. Now I'm feeling like a micro psycho. Stand back, cause I'm feeling like a might blow. Slim chance, but I'm putting up a fight though. They tell me it's the wrong path, but I know it's right though. Let to pick up the world and shake it. Throw it to the ground and laugh as I break it. Let the whole world know that I'ma make it. And if you don't give it to me, then I'm gonna take it. Beast mode, I'm in beast mode. Gonna for the top, cock back, reload. I'm a new man with a new attitude, but don't get me wrong, I'm still me though. I'm all in now, I ain't bluffing. I risk everything, regret nothing. My determination's disgusting. So every day my ass, I'm busting. Let me take it back, break it down. Just a couple more months, then college bound. Got a scholarship, my bags were packed, and my world turned upside down. When I got that phone call, so shocking. I thought my heart was stopping. Are you serious? This is a one in a lifetime opportunity knocking. But wait, what now? Thought I had my whole life figured out. Everything I was once sure about. I was now skepticism and doubt. I almost lost control, lost sanity. Meanwhile, my friends abandoned me. I felt lost in the world for a little bit. Had nobody but my family. But I bounced back and got in the zone. Late nights, just me and the microphone. My friends were up in college while I was right here sitting at home. They were partying, I was cutting tracks. They were going out, I was making sacks. It's the road I chose, so you know I'm in a walk here proudly and never look back. Now, fast forward a couple years. Most of my fears have disappeared after the blood, the sweat, and tears. I dedicate this right here to all my non believers and haters. Y'all doing me nothing but favors. Keep talking, I can't hear you. Someone go to me, a translator. I used to get to me, to the old me. Think you can do better than show me. Those who know me least have the most to say. Don't judge me if you don't know me. Whether I'm a billionaire, flat broke, you think that matters? Is that a joke? If you ain't got talent, you really think money will get you anywhere? Nope. Oh, you wanna play music monopoly? I've mastered the game, no tapping me. Taking over the world, what I'm gonna get up on this passing go, there's no stopping me. I work so hard, I earned it. It's mine now, and I'll never return it. I'ma do it, I'ma do it so damn big. Every day my fans confirm it. So blast off, I'm out of here. Out of this world to the atmosphere. So long, I'm gone. Been a hell of a ride with a year, it's just the start. The beginning, the top of the very first inning. No need for a concert, a full pan, bottom of the ninth, and I'll still be winning. What I went through, it was worth it all. All the times we have pinned up against the wall, trying to please my family, friends, and fans. When it's all said and done, after all, I gotta do what's right for me. I gotta chase after this dream. I'm so proud of us, how far we came, me and my whole damn team. God, I'm just doing my best. For real, I feel so blessed. I think somebody's watching over me. Tell me, world, did I pass your test? Did I do this right? Please tell me. I need you now, please help me. Cause life don't come with no manual. I played the cards that you tell me. My life is on the line every time I rhyme. Always on my grind 24 7. So much on my mind, someone please remind me. Did I be fine? Where am I heading to the fans? My life I owe you. So close to my heart, I hold you. But to anyone who ever thought of doubting me, I'm so proud to say that I told you.
get paid.